Hello there. Feast your eyes firstly, ladies and gentlemen, at that Art 170 fighter from the 30th anniversary. I can't wait to open that. Um, I've only just taken it out of the box it got delivered in. Uh, together with the Tungori package, which I've already just videoed. And now, before the sun sets, I am so eager to find out what is in here. This is a delivery from a good friend of mine, Luke B, who is a Patreon member and, you know, much valued supporter of the channel. Thank you so much, Luke, for all you give and help and support this channel via Patreon. So, let's get in there, man. Wow, it's been on a journey. Oh, and look what we have. Look at what we have here. We got a little letter. Hope you don't mind me reading this out, Luke. I'm sure it'll be all right. Dear Only One Kenobi, greetings from Atlanta, USA. Hope and trust you're doing well. I have been to Atlanta in 1993 and 94, respectively. <laughs> um, went to the Coca-Cola, uh, went to the Coca-Cola factory as well. And uh, I do remember that like it was yesterday. It was all good. Um, happy to see how much you enjoyed your recent visit to Disney World, including Galaxy's Edge. I'm also glad that you seemed to recover pretty quickly from your recent bout of C-19. Um, your collection rooms are looking good, my friend. The giant cylinders in the carded room are quite the innovation, giving you more room without having to go out into the hall, the corridor. Yeah, that was it. Oh, the hall, the car corridor, the landing, man. We call it the landing up here because I'm on the top floor. Uh, you probably do as well, I don't know. <laughs> uh, no spoilers here about the enclosed. We'll let them speak mostly for themselves with a bit of help from some attached notes. Wishing you all the best for the autumn. Cheers, Luke B. Great, thank you so much, Luke. Oh, wow, look what we have here. Straight away, a classic car back. Indeed it is, look at that. 40th anniversary. As you know, I don't collect the six inch, so that is really nice, Luke. I'll, I'll keep hold of that frame that classic XL card back I assume that is the 40th anniversary of um, yeah what did I do I did open one of these but I think I might have even recarded him and look at that it's great I did have a Ben Kenobi I, th oh, I think I opened the uh, I had a black series one in the blue but in, in the red box so I never opened the carded one I, I think I sold the ones I had without the figure being taken off. So uh, yeah, that's great. That's awesome, I'll have that. And wow, lucky what we have here. Now he did actually mention a while ago about Indiana Jones and uh, what's this, Unpunched, what? What is this? Oh, wow. Look at that. You're watching this BOE. What do you make of that? That is Unpunched. It's a tops card. Look at that. That's really nice, man. Look at that for the 40th anniversary year is not over yet and i'm getting nice little things like that that's great now that's getting put into my special box when i get things sent to me like little cards or things like that they get put straight away into a hard box which is good thank you man that's lovely and what is it wow oh wow what 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 are you doing man look at this he's sending me back my patches i'll have to send you some more, more man i'll have to i did take a quick photograph of your p.o box before i blanked it out there and that is insane. That is madness. What is he doing? <laughs> Should be me sending you this. Yeah, I did send him a load of patches, but look at that. He's sending that back. That is insane. Look at that. Luke B, official merch for merchandise supplier, <laughs> for a distributor for the Only One Kenobi channel. Well, that's pretty cool, man. I love that. I like it, man. Let's put it on. I might have to adjust the strap. Do you reckon? Is it all right? Do you like it, Luke? <laughs> Great, man. I shall keep that on for the rest of this video. And then I've obviously got my eyes on that firmly, ladies and gentlemen. I can't wait to see that. And then look, oh wow, look at this. It's like a plastic beaker, but that, my God, please don't tell me that's from the 1980s. That's insane. Um, and what is in there? Oh, there's a figure in there. Oh, it's another one of that. Look at that, better than TVC. Well, Luke B, it is better than TVC. Now, if you do keep an eye on my channel, you might not have seen the video where Daniel Chart sent me some goodies and he sent me one of these, but I did want another. You can, in fact, you can't have too many of these kind of Imperials. So that is brilliant. Let me get him out of there. And let's have a look. Wow, thank you, Luke. That's really nice, man. It's really kind. It's always nice to get things like this. I get like a gift, isn't it, man? It's a lovely thing. I hope I can 
We pay all your kind generosity by giving you, hopefully, what is considered good content, including the review of that coming up soon. So there you go. And then let's have a look again at this beaker. I'd love to know if there was a date on here. If it said, oh, 2004 Lucasfilm. Sorry, can you see that? There you go. So it's not a vintage item from the 80s. Not that that matters, but I like that, man. That'd be nice. I shall drink my apple juice out of that, man. Or keep it somewhere safe. Maybe I'll put it with all this other stuff up. Look up there, man. Look up, up there. And my original plan for these shelves up there was to put, like, you know, ships and maybe figures up there. But it's turning into a kind of a, a hard goods section of merch. A little stuff from Galaxy's Edge there. I've got um, Ian Bowden. I've got your Yoda there. And, yeah, it's pretty cool. So there you go. Let's just keep that there for now. What else? Oh, man. I don't know. Whether... Let's have a look at this one here. Oh my God, legendary Kenner mail away. Wow. Tim, are you watching this man? I mean, this means nothing to me really. I don't know much about Kenner, stuff like that, but that is, is that like, that's obviously a vintage, that's got, that's a vintage eighties. Bosk, that will go nicely with me. Me Boba Fett that I've got loose. Look at this, wow. That's awesome, Luke, thank you so much. That will be cherished, man. See up here, I've got like, Boba Fett up there, the vintage 80s one, next to the Slave One, but he will go buy it. That's great. Thank you, man. That's really, really nice. I like it. I used to have Bosk. This one looks like he's got that pinky feature, and I have come across that before. Um, I don't think mine would have aged quite like that. I must have had a, di a different type of Bosk, the one I had in the 80s, but like a pinky head. and Interesting. I'm sure there'll be loads of boffins watching this and will know exactly what... That is, but yeah, the legendary Kenner, Kenner mail away. Wow, that's awesome. That's brilliant. Nice case as well. Thank you. What else? Um, I'm gonna. There's something underneath the Indiana, in the Indiana Jones thing that I don't want to see what it is yet. So I'm gonna just sit back, close that, and then let's have a look at this. What have we got here? We've got Mutt Williams, got Indiana Jones with Crystal Skull, and we've got Irana Spalco. And look at that three pack. That's awesome. I wonder where I can Easter egg these. Only at Walmart as well. Look at that. Great. Yeah, Mutt Williams is pretty cool. I quite like, I like the Crystal Skull. I regret not going to watch Dial of Destiny. I heard too many bad things and I just thought I don't want to be butt hurt again, you know, by Lucasfilm. I've been hurt, still sore from <laughs> seeing The Rise of Skywalker, man. So, um, yeah. Oh, what are oh, Luke B.? Bloody hell, Luke, are you in tandem with my thought processes or something? This is awesome. This was the next thing I had my eye on, basically. I did a lot of opening at the beginning of 2023, a lot of um, Phantom Menace stuff, and this was something I had in mind. You see it really briefly, don't you? There they are. Fire. It's the flash speeder. Wow. I need to think about where I'm going to put that. Just been rearranging, as you know, the shelves here. I can't wait to give you some shelf tours. You know, it's coming back soon, that. No joke really really got my act together and i've been really working hard in here but i'll have to figure out where i'll put it but it'll be somewhere to the left there and this is the flash speed are you watching in in bowden again man because he was um talking about this not long ago showing me pictures of his that's great this is awesome thank you so much luke oh there's a couple of more things in the bottom here what a lovely score man this is incredible a <laughs> score you know what i mean what is this He's labelled it. Who do you think you are? Daniel Chart? Figgies get thirsty. Who do you think you are? Daniel East 1000? Calling him Figgies. <laughs> Speaking of Daniels, Daniel Chart, Daniel East 1000. Look at that. Oh my God, you see, look at this. I hope you don't mind me saying, Luke, that Luke um, may have a connection with Coca-Cola. I will say no more than that. But that is absolutely awesome. I love that, Luke. I love it because... That's the connection that me and you have. Obviously, I know that you are a Patreon follower and we have um, we know each other via that means, but we have a connection in that, you know, you're from Atlanta and I have been to Atlanta in 93 and 94. Went to the Coca-Cola factory in 93. 94, I think we just went to Hard Rock Cafe. <laughs> um, but yeah, we were, we're, we're, yeah, been to Atlanta a couple of times uh, and also for layovers as well. But that is brilliant. Oh, I love it, man. Where am I going to put that? There's loads of places I could put it. I could put it in the barge, one in the barge, maybe. I could definitely put it in the Navarro um, cantina. 
And is that Jack Daniels there? Is that JD? Look at that. I love it, man. Tennessee whiskey, man. I love it. Absolutely love it. And I guess, you know, let me get them out, filming them in a bag. God, they're actually feeling like they're not made out of plastic. They're made out of like marble or something. Oh, come on now. Be reasonable. There you go. Excuse me. Excuse me there. It just wasn't focusing. Look at them. You see, almost, like, almost looks like little bubbles in there. I love it. And then you've got that there. I'm guessing, is that just a cardboard thing? Was that like a magnet of some kind? Still, it looks cool, man. I think I'm going to be putting that in my Navarro cantina. That would be rude not to have that hanging behind the barman. <laughs> what do you reckon? It may, may, might feel too much like Earth, though. Who cares? Why not? Easter egg it in. That's great. And there is something else, I think, in the box. Yes, there's this. And who knows what that is? Let's find out now. I wonder what this is. Is this going to be something that's going to blow me away? The final thing I opened is absolutely put this video over. Or is it going to be just something that's just the last thing I open? <laughs> but um, everything's been so amazing so far, Luke. So I'm very happy to receive such amazing things. Early Hasbro mail away. Mm -hmm. I wonder what this is, ladies and gentlemen. What have we got here? Oh... Wow, please let it be. Yes, it is. It is. Thank you, mate. That is just what I want. That's going to go so nicely over there, Luke B, on my Dagobah shelf. That's just so good, man. I mean, look at that. That's exactly what I needed. Thank you, mate. And what have we got here? This is, you know, it's Kenner because Kenner did own it. Power of the Force 2. Hasbro took over around about Phantom Menace time. Get $5 in Star Wars cash by mail when you buy any one of the following. How about that? Slave One, X-Wing, Snowspeeder or the Millennium Falcon. How about that? Should I, should I send off with that? Should I do it? Should I send to that address? See what happens? Wouldn't it be funny if I if I won? I doubt it. That's great. Now I'm going to set all that up for a nice photograph, maybe maybe for the thumbnail of this video. But Luke, thank you very much indeed. I don't know what else to say other than you're amazing. I appreciate that. I've been looking forward to that ever since you said you wanted to send it. And it has arrived and it is delivered, man. Literally, it has delivered. <laughs> thank you. I'm really happy. And thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you have enjoyed it. Do give the video a like and subscribe if you want you. This has been only one Kenobi, only one.